270 bypass around St. Louis, westbound, south of St. Louis, and you hit I-44 west, you're going to exit 270, get on I-44, headed toward Tulsa, you're going to go all the way down to 20 miles an hour on this curve, and it, you approach it going downhill, so the tendency is to speed up and then you got to brake really hard. You gotta start slowing down at the top of the hill. And this is Sunday afternoon. On a weekday, it's hard just to get into that lane because it's packed, it's busy. Now you come around and you think, all right, we're gonna get right on I-44. So you start speeding up. And then suddenly, there's a merge lane from your left really tight curve. Your lane ends. In three quarters of a mile. You're thinking you should be speeding up, but actually you can only do this at 40 miles an hour. And now you think, now I'm on the highway, but you're not. Here you are on the side road. You still got to get on the highway. False starts, speed up, slow down, over the bridge, under the sign, jump this concrete barrier and we're on our way.
to hold from Six Flags. Paperwork at the ready. Arriving at 1100 Matlock Drive on the left. Oh, somebody went in the mud there. Yeah, we've been to this one. Reaching Lord Lord RDC number 6069. Yeah. Might have, like I said, it might have been this exact run from Mobile to here. Except on this road itself. It's quite possible. slide tandems at the gate, it says. Thanks for joining us today. We hope you liked the video. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up. Remember to put your comments and questions below. And of course, if you like traveling with us, be sure to subscribe to our channel, hit the notification bell. And uh, hey, let's see. Oh, we hope that our tip at the beginning of the video is helpful to you if you're ever taking that exit. And be sure to join us in the next video when we head inside this Walmart distribution center and are hoping that we'll get a load 
before our time is up. All right, we'll see you then with love from Kevin and Tanya. Bye.